the concept of Sportsic is that everyone can contribute. So anyone who can use their smartphone to uh, take a picture, shoot a video, or write a text message can use Sportrick and be part of uh, their team's reporter team. But what we like to help Croydon with and what we think that they can get out of this, just like any other club on, on their type of level, is to have a, a simple app and a, a media platform that will enable them to create the same type of coverage from their games uh, as today's made for the big games with big, big production teams. So we were very lucky to be put into contact for a local supporter with Sportswick. Once we got chatting it seemed like there was some really good synergy between what we wanted to achieve at Croydon and what Sportswick were looking to try, to, to try and do which was we need to get more people through the gate, we need to galvanise a community, we need to try and engage in, in the big numbers that, that are living in Croydon that currently are not attending Croydon Football Club. Um, Sportswick want to try and have a flagship uh, club to be able to showcase what they can do and what, they, what the software and the technology can do. So it seemed like a perfect marriage. If you're a resident of Croydon, uh, you'll know firsthand of the passion that people have for Croydon and um, all the facilities available to people here. Uh, we're seeing new uh, centres like here, Sussex Innovation Croydon, opened just two years ago and a lot of new entrepreneurs, businesses succeeding here in Croydon. I think from the partnership sports we can get really positive brand association with not only Croydon Football Club and the brand and style of football we're going to play but also with the Community Foundation and the charitable endeavours which we look to, to, to do and galvanise the community and create positive change in, in Croydon. I was really excited to see as a, as a brilliant example of, of what I'm talking about Croydon FC embracing what's happening in Croydon and saying yeah we want a piece of that too and what they've done is they've said yeah okay Croydon FC is about football but they've said you know, how can tech help us? So they've embraced, embraced Sportswick, which is very much at the, at the cutting edge of, of technology and sports and how do you promote sports effectively and how do you use the new wave of social media and how do you capitalise all that? It's a huge step forward. The club are reliant upon volunteers and, and certain sponsorship deals and Sportswick give us, uh, give us a huge amount of resources and uh, infrastructure in the, in the marketing and advertising of the club, which we would just simply wouldn't have the time or, or expertise to be able to do without them. So. It's massive for us to try and raise the club. So for the future of Sportsvik, uh, we see that, that getting off very well in Sweden, now getting onto the UK market, we, we uh, want to, to launch uh, globally within uh, the upcoming year, because we believe that the need for Sportsvik, for everyone who's passionate about sports to be able to follow their team and, and share their the passion, uh, is something that exists in all global markets where pe people are passionate about sports. So, and, and that's where we, we want to be as well.